Hoian. It's a beautiful town, and it's the tailoring capital of Vietnam. But before you run down and get a suit made, there are a few things I think you should know. And hopefully, uh, you'll be able to avoid some of the mistakes that I made when I went there. Well, I'm here at Anne's place on the balcony of my guest room, and I just thought I would give you a few pointers on getting tailored suits in this town. A couple of do's and don'ts. I guess number one most important don't is don't rush it. Although these uh, tailors claim to be able to get you a suit done in 24 hours from the time you measure to the time you pick it up, uh, that's that's without fittings and. Uh, I really strongly don't recommend that you just get a suit without having any fittings. Uh, you do, do come in for at least two different fittings. You go in, you get yourself measured, come back at least two different times, check it out, try the suit, bend it around, sit down, touch your toes, kick your knees up, whatever you need to do to find if it's comfortable. And do ask for them to alter it. Don't feel ashamed to say, oh, it's a little too tight here, or it's a little too long there. They're more than willing to rip the seams out and re-sew it. So, no sweat. They'll adjust it for you. So, do take your time, be patient, and uh, you should be uh, satisfied if you're able to do that. Additionally, uh, I would say don't just try the, or get your suit done at the first tailor you walk into. Do, however, do some research ahead of time. Go on some forums, some websites, look around. You don't have to take my word, my recommendations. I think they're good, but I'm sure there's a number of other tailors which are good. However, for every good tailor, there's probably about five or six not so good ones. And I've heard a lot of people complaining about tailors in Hoi An, and I think that's because, number one, they don't go in and have it re or altered several times. And number two, they just go into one and they don't really know what they're getting into. And a third thing is, is make sure you know exactly what you have in mind. Do bring along pictures and try to give a very clear and simple explanation. Know what you want and be able to have pictures that show a suit from a couple different angles, able to show the detail like the, the lapels or the pockets or the cuffs or the collar or wh whatever you have in mind. So make sure you come prepared ahead of time know what it's going to look like, have some pictures, have a clear description, even write it down in nice short little clear bullet points. And um, also know what kind of fabric you want. And if you do that, you should be able to do quite well. Sometimes the, uh, the shops don't have the fabric you need. Well, don't worry, there's a fabric market in Hoi An and there's lots of other tailors you can go into and just ask for the fabric. So. Um, you know, if, if you don't, if the tailor doesn't have what you want, go into another shop or a fabric shop and get the fabric and bring it to the tailor and they'll be willing to sew the, fa the fabric up for you. Ooh, it's kind of warm out here. Anyways, um, although you should pay between anywhere from between $60 or maybe $220 for a suit depending on the fabric and how many pieces to it and the material. Um, and the details. Um, yeah, I wouldn't say pay pay much more than 250. If you're paying 250 or more for just like a, a two-piece suit, eh, you're probably getting ripped off. Uh, but the, the, all you have to do is shop around, and you might even try uh, asking them to, get to cut the price a little bit. You know, ask if they can knock 25, 30 dollars off off the price. Uh, they may not say yes, but you know, give it a shot. Uh, I don't know. I tried three different tailors. I don't know if you should necessarily do that. Mm, some people say you should. Some people should, you say you should just go to one and have all your stuff made. I, I'm, I'm really not sure. Well, whatever, whatever works for you, I would say. Um, and you know what? Frankly, if you know what you're doing, if you know what you want, and if you're willing to take your time and be very clear and ask for alterations, you should be able to get a, a full wardrobe made here. I mean, you, they'll make just about anything. I just got this shirt made recently. It's light, it's comfortable, and uh, it's, it's really cheap. You know, like $20, $25 for a custom-made shirt. And, uh, you know, like I said, the prices on the suits. 
There are plenty of other places in Asia and in Vietnam as well that you can get custom-made clothes. Hoi An's not the only one. However, there's a lot of tailors around, so they'll probably be able to give you pretty good pricing and a wide selection. So yeah, I mean, if you're interested in getting some, some clothes made and, uh, you know, pack light, bring extra large bags <laughs> with lots of space and take a week or so and get exactly what you want, the, the way you want it. And I'd recommend it. I've had a really good experience here. Hoi An's great. Small town. Well, at least it is right now. It'll probably grow a lot for now, but it's got a nice small town atmosphere. Friendly people, close to the beach, close to interesting things like Mison and Da Nang and you a little bit of ways away from Hue, but give it a shot. I enjoyed my time. See what you think.